Hello and welcome to the first segment in your free e-course. This is the first mini video guitar lesson in a series of 12. And in case you didn't already realise, I'm going to send you one of these videos every couple of days for nearly a month. And with each one of these segments, we're going to learn different techniques. For example, I'm going to show you chords, I'm going to show you strumming patterns, finger picking, I'm going to show you a blues scale, a minor scale, I'm going to show you bar chords, and I'm going to show you different styles like rock and roll and funk, and I'm going to teach you how to improvise as well all in this 12 part free course so I'm really excited for you because by the time you've wor worked your way through all of these segments and in a month's time from now you're gonna have a good understanding about all the the most important things you need to know about playing guitar and with that knowledge um, and of course assuming that you've practiced everything I tell you to practice along the way you're then gonna be able to go away and play all sorts of different songs whatever you want to play or even write your own songs if that's what you want to do so you really are in the right place um, but one thing I want you to remember this free course really is aimed at beginner guitarists so if you've already been playing for a while for example in this first lesson I'm going to teach you the names of the strings and I'm going to show you how to hold down the notes on the guitar and I'm also going to show you how to tune the guitar in this lesson but if you already understand how to tune the guitar then what I suggest you do is either two things you can wait a few days for the next segment in this course and with each segment we're going to learn more and more interesting in stuff or in the meantime feel free to go and look at the website vguitarlessons.com and you'll find all sorts of songs to learn there and they're slightly more challenging so if you want to go straight ahead and jump in the deep end while you're waiting for each one of these segments then you know I, I totally encourage you to do that that's fine and you can learn any song you want on the website so in the meantime for those of you that are new to guitar uh, let's begin now the first thing I want to teach you is the names of the strings now what you need to know is the strings are numbered from one to six the first string is the thinnest string so they're numbered one two three four five six and the sixth string is the thickest string okay so let's look at the left hand now so the first thing I want to tell you is these lines are known as frets and what I want to ask you to do is take your first finger and put it on the sixth string at fret one now it's important to realize that you should put your finger right next to the fret not on top of it and not too far this way either you should put it right next to the fret and that's the perfect place so if you use a plectrum to give that string a pluck and then you can use your middle finger to step onto fret two and then the third finger onto fret three and the little finger onto fret four good and then once you've done that you can step backwards fret four fret three fret two fret one now there is a reason I'm asking you to do this I know it seems simple but it's important at this stage that you learn to spread your fingers out and to build the strength and the flexibility in your fingers because unfortunately some people get into the bad habit of learning to play guitar just with one finger and really you know that is a bad habit to get into and it's not going to get you very far so I want to start right up front by beginning as we mean to go on and get you into good habits right from the start and it'll make everything else you play so much more easier from now on good now the other thing I want to tell you is when you pluck a string with no fingers this is known as open so the six string open is this good so the exercise that I'm gonna ask you to practice between now and the next time I see you in a few days time is to start with open on the sixth string fret 1 fret 2 fret 3 fret 4 back to fret 3 back to fret 2 back to fret 1 and open now I want you to practice this repeatedly and to build the speed and the smoothness that you can play it so play it over and over again and once you've done it on the sixth string then I want you to move on to the next string so do the same thing on the fifth string and carry on through the guitar on each string so remember it's not a race it's not important that you play it as fast as you can what's important at this stage is you learn to hold down the notes you know we're learning to pluck the strings with the plectrum and we're learning to spread our fingers out that's what's important but I do want you to challenge yourself and push yourself and build your speed and by all means see if you can get it going as fast as you can and that would be brilliant <laughs> OK, 
Okay, so that's your exercise for today. I want you to practice that. Now, there's one more thing I want to show you in this lesson, and that's how to tune the guitar. Because, of course, tuning the guitar is vitally important. If the guitar's not in tune, then everything you play is going to sound awful. So, you know, I, I want to show you how to do this properly right from the start. So, the best thing I suggest for you to do is to get hold of one of these little electric guitar tuners. Um, they're quite cheap. In fact, you can buy them off of our website, vguitarlessons.com, and we'll post one out to you. Um, but if you don't get one from us, make sure you get one from somewhere, from a music shop or something, because they're really simple to use, they're really useful. And to be perfectly honest, you can tune guitar by ear, and there's a lesson on our website that will teach you to do that. But the best thing for us to do initially, uh, the simplest thing, is to use an electric tuner. Now, I've got one over here that's got a bigger lighting display on it that is easier for you to see on the video. So let's take a look at it. So let me tell you, um, if we go back to the, the right hand now, you need to know the names of the notes. The sixth string is an E note, the fifth string is an A, the fourth string is a D, the third string is a G, the second string is a B, and the first string is an E. So what I'm going to do for the purpose of this lesson is to put my guitar out of tune and then I'm going to demonstrate to you putting it back in tune and you can see the process and you can learn how to do it yourself by watching me. Okay, so let's put it out of tune now. Okay, so the guitar is safely out of tune now, so we need to begin putting it back in tune. So, I want to begin with the sixth string, and of course the sixth string should be an E note. So, if we give it a plug, the tuner will tell us how far out of tune it is. Okay, so I'm going to turn the tuning peg and bring that note up until we get it back to an E, like it should be. And when it goes green, we know we're in tune. So now we move on to the fifth string, and of course the fifth string should be an A note. I'm just going to gently turn the peg until we get it back to an A. Good. And now the fourth string should be a D note. And I'm turning that one down. Get it back to a D, good. And now the third string should be a G. 